guys. Yes, it's Eclipse of the Dragon again. And also, yes, the music you heard during the fight, and as I did some gathering, is not the Ephestria default music. It is not even downloaded with the Ephestria game. Nope. That music and the game have got nothing to do with each other. That's a quick mod I made. Quite simple. And in this video I'm going to show you guys how you can also alter the music to your liking. First thing we need to do is go to or track down a particular folder. In my case, I have created a shortcut directly to it, since I already know precisely where it is. And no need to worry about trying to read this and all. To make it easier on you guys, I will copy this to the description, so that you can at least find it very easily quite simple, just track down your history uh, folder, go into it, then copy this and paste it to the address bar, and click on go. And you'll be there. Now you have a good 120 files of music and other things to work with here but there are a select few I would recommend you don't alter the killing ones and the leveling up ones now those are particularly useful exactly as they are I would not go recommending you alter them. As for me, I have decided to not change them, just leave them the way they are. Now, first thing you might want to do is copy all these files to an old music folder like I have. This way, when you have made your adjustments, you can easily and quickly jump back and forth between the old music and your new music freely. Without having to have the old stuff downloaded again. Now these are just some of the files that I have gone and converted. I've gone and alterized and substituted into the game. Of course there is one serious rule if you're going to go and do this. Use only and I mean only mp3 files. It makes it quite a lot easier to simply find the file you want, copy the name of whatever you want to replace it with, and then paste that name onto a copy of the file you want to use. With the old files safely secured here, just copy the new file here and have it replace whatever one you want to replace out. Now there is a certain rule to the mp3s that you use. They cannot be mp3s that have been downloaded as something like AAC and then just the AAC at the end changed to MP3. That will not work. 
all you will get in the game is some shit music. Trust me. I know. I've been there and done that. I tried it and it came out complete garbage during the first fight. So. What you'll want to do is convert them. And what you'll want is this. What you'll want to do is come here, scroll down, click the download link, and click on save file. Save it. Yeah, save file. Now I'm not going to download it because I already have it. And I already have it installed, so it's completely pointless in me installing it again. Don't worry, I'll leave a link to the internet site in the description alongside the folder shortcut for you. Alright, when you first run it, this is what you'll end up with. Very nice little layout. So. Go find the file that we want. Just bear with me a sec, guys. Perfect. It's the exact type of file that I originally used. So I use this as an example. <laughs> Actually, I'll use another file. These two. These two will not work for the um, conversion use that you're going to use them for, as they are not MP3. So, click, drag, open this, and simply drop them. Now at the here, don't just go hitting the conversion button because it will not convert to what you want. And of course, hunting down what we do want is going to take forever. And that's this humongous list. What we want is in the musical note or audio files. Second from the top. MP3 audio. Click that. And click convert now. No, pretty obvious. Just let it do its thing. And here are the two converted files. Format changed from the old original that it was to MP3. No, I just click 
copy the name of the original file that you want to replace. I use this one. Paste it. Then cut or copy whatever one you want. I'm not going to do either because I don't want to do this. Paste it here and replace the old original. Not sure if I said this already, but before you start replacing, make sure that you've got the old files in the old file, the old music folder, so you can jump freely between your new ones and the old ones, and have your ones in there so you can quickly identify it. Once done, simple. Run the game. And it will automatically analyze the new files and scan them into the game using them rather than the old music. So that's basically all there is to it. Hope this information has been useful and will help you guys out. That's how you change the history of music. Well, guess the only thing to say now is see you guys later. Bye.